Hello everybody, and welcome back to episode 11 of Shin DS2, the 100% talk through. So you might be asking yourself, what the heck is this scene going on here? This looks familiar. Well, I only have a shorter time to stream at the moment, so I wanted to go ahead and get this objective out of the way. I still need to show off the boss in Jehanum Gate, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. Without any teammates, without any gear, I worked myself back up to this part. So let's see how we do. I don't have too much to add from what I had said last time we did this area initially. But since we're fighting both of the bosses this time around, I will say that it is very important to grind. And that Sanctuary Scroll right there is going to be one of the biggest keys to grinding successfully in this area. Since we have access to such a powerful scroll, we're definitely going to abuse it. <laughs> Not so magical sprite. I can do that! Alright, looks like this floor is all cleared. We did hit level 2. <clears throat> I won't stick around this floor. We'll definitely try to get our grinding done later on when the opportunity presents itself. This is the eight rooms and a long hallway around it. Yep. There's all sorts of goodies in here. So hopefully. I'm looking for a couple particular items. I very much would like a doppelganger staff and a couple more sanctuary scrolls, at least one more if possible. For what I have in mind. And this isn't my main save file, this is a separate state. And thanks to safe states, I'm actually going to be able to show off what happens when you lose to the final boss. When you lose by letting him grow all the way. So that's pretty cool. I look forward to showing that cutscene, even though Sharon's going to be completely obliterated. <laughs> but all in the name of sharing something a lot of people probably never get to see because they don't hold the A and B button. <laughs> in that fight. <clears throat> so you'll see what I mean by that. And this episode will probably just contain this trip. I uh, definitely, I don't know if I'll be streaming more tonight. If I do, we'll be back to our regularly scheduled programming. Ooh, last shield. Pretty nifty. Too bad I can't keep anything in this file. I was half expecting to encounter a lot of pickaxes or something. <laughs> Some of the things that I've been hunting in our normal file. Still no staffs yet though. That's what we're looking for. That's what we want. Especially doppelganger, so I can level up some enemies. If not, then all the grinding will occur on the floors that have the samurai 
guys. What's up, catchy? Alright. We can still move about freely once we clear the forest. So long as I'm like two, one level ahead on average. That could be what I've been looking for. If I'm lucky. Now it's not necessary to get a doppelganger staff, but it will make leveling up a lot easier. And actually, I'm gonna hold on to this restore herb. I'm gonna want as many healing items as possible for the first form of the boss. So, unless we find a jar of healing, I won't use that for HP. Apparently my hunger is going to be set though. <laughs> Let's see, nothing down there. Hey, how are you? Take care out there. <laughs> I always forget uh, the darker blue of these guys is the knockback staff. <laughs> Oh, oh, you, you, of course you'd leave after pushing me around, son of a bitch. <laughs> hey, you have a store. I don't think I can steal. Not that I would want to. Well, I might want to. Eh, I'll leave it alone. I don't think I could easily steal. <clears throat> it would take too much effort. Hey, you. Alright, postpone. Not the one we're looking for, but useful nonetheless. Oh my. It might be a good time to use my sanctuary scroll. We'll see how we do without using it. Ugh. <laughs> the cursed arrows are not what I wanted. Unless. Oh, they became uncursed. Okay. Well, I'll do my best to fight this off. I will probably have to use my scroll though. <laughs> that sprite levels up. Could be a problem. Let's. Probably should have powered up first. Power up now. Oh boy. Oh man. <laughs> so, don't do what I did. How many things are in front of this trouble spray? <laughs> I was hoping it was the next one over so it would just hit me or walk to me. Okay, I might die here. I have to put this down unfortunately. Maybe the trouble sprite can level up a bit though. Oh, he <laughs> knocked the arrow into me. Just in case he knocks me out of here. I don't know though. Maybe he can hit. He won't cast his magic now that he's next to me. Oh, he will. Never mind then. I'll make as much use of this floor as I can. One tough ninja to hit. Kinda want the trouble sprite to level up. Kinda do. 
Hey, there it goes. Now, I don't know what a bat sprite does, but... <laughs> I'm about to find out when it gets here. Oh, 9 XP, really? Not worth! <laughs> so not worth. Alright, we got tons of food. So I will milk the floor. If I don't hit any pitfalls, I suppose I should check for traps, as I don't have an easy way of doing that. Six charge staff, that's probably like a swap. Or a random. So, one thing I do notice, uh, your stuff is saved, your most popular words, even though I'm on like a different, because I had to start the file from scratch, all I did was use a safe state so I don't lose my data on the old file, and then put this on a separate safe state, but the same game cartridge remembers your dialogue. Doesn't matter about the save file. Ho oh, hum. I don't mind checking for traps like this too much. Because I need more enemies to spawn anyway. Let's see, what is that staff? Ooh, four copy? It'd be what I'm looking for. Find out. Nope, just to paralyze. Uh, apparently, I don't have paralyze anymore. <laughs> I would do fun names if I could. Maybe in Sharon 1, I'll make up some fun names. But the six character limit's really limiting. So I'll just keep it super serial for the time being. Alright. Uh, do I have an ID? A not cursed ID? I'll wait before I try to ID that. Probably just a jar of holding. But if it's a jar of... <clears throat> melding or healing, it'd be really useful. I don't even think I need that Sanctuary spell anymore. Alright, what do we got? Well, I got lucky with that one. This is a uh, holding. I was kind of hoping one of them were holding so I can store all my junk here. The other one is melting with a really, really good shield. <laughs> of course that's a uh, curse, so why would I not find a cursed one with that? I do want as much money as possible. Because one of the key things to grinding high-level enemies is the use of Guyton Bags. Alright, let's try to figure out what this is. I'm gonna put in the Beetle Shield. It disappeared, so this is the healing jar! It's pretty good to find. Not a melt, though. Alright, uh, I'll get these items and then go back to the top right. Mm -hmm. 
kind of don't want to keep checking for traps. Say the whole room. This is tedious. Antidote. Let's eat it. Right, items. We'll exchange the. Well, I'll eat a large one you give me, since I have way more than 100 fullness. Oh, that would have been really good. I thought I held the uh, B button, but guess not. Kijel. Mine's a two already, so that I'll ignore in case it's cursed. Don't defy. I don't really need it anymore, but I'll exchange that one. Five herb. I think I will. Let's eat this too. Why not? It's a waste of food, but we got tons of food. We're actually very well prepared for beating this already. And this is what you want to have happen to you when you do Johannum Gate. Alright, let's just walk. <laughs> no fear. Alright. Uh... Let's finish checking out what else is on the floor. I'll be back for these things. Power-up scroll is really good to have because it's one of the only scrolls that actually work on these bosses. You remember how the last form was? They, uh... Oh, that's my sanctuary. Alright. Bosses don't care about magic. Okay. Uh, let's see. Having two power ups. I am going to do both forms of the boss again just to show that it can be done. Let's get rid of the identify scroll. Why not? Yep, random staff. And I'll spend the rest of this floor. Over here. So we're gonna grind it since we have this skull down and we have plenty of food. This is uh, what you wanna do. If you had a fullness arm band, it would be even better, but no worries there. Now just make sure you leave before the, like, after the third wind blows. You need, you have a hundred turns, I think, to get to the stairs. If you don't trust it, Leave after the second one, please. Okay, so there's the third one. And we shall head for the staircase. Careful not to step on any spring traps along your way. <laughs> so far, really good start. Really good start, and that's coming in here empty handed. Hey there! Sleep, strength, holding 2250? That could be a melding in this game, I forget. <laughs> Honestly. We'll see if we can't steal from this store. He's got some good stuff. One thing that 
in the future I want to test and actually since I'm already operating on safe states I might if I find a sanctuary scroll I will put a safe state and test this out but I'm really curious if the shopkeeper can't touch you when you have a sanctuary scroll now sheriffs and the hounds always constantly spawn. So you could end up completely screwed. The sanctuary scroll is not necessarily the best answer unless you put it in a hallway to like a really good hallway to block them off from the staircase. But I want to see if it does protect you from the shopkeeper and the sheriffs and hounds. Because one of the things that happens in this game, the shopkeeper and the hounds and the sheriffs, they can all level up to four. So you need a safe way to deal with a level four shopkeeper if you want to unlock it in the compendium. And I believe the level 4 shopkeeper is the most dangerous enemy in the game. <clears throat> the double movement, double attack, and the highest raw damage output. It's pretty unfair in the game. <laughs> but he only has 250 HP. Shopkeeper always has 250 HP. Now, the staircase is not quite in a convenient enough location for safe steel. Let's see. could postpone four things, but that's a lot of walking I would have to do. I could random some other stuff. I could paralyze the shopkeeper to keep him still, so I would just have to worry about sheriffs and hounds. But I don't think I can make it out safely. So, with my 1000 guidance, I will maybe get that strength herb that they had. stuff. I should buy the holding jar that he has instead. Thirteen hundred. one. That's why I can organize. I could sell the other two things there on the ground on the right, but I don't really care about a confused herb and a sleep herb. If you really need the assistance, I would sell them both. Just to make a little more money, maybe you can buy something else. I, uh, doubt it, but... Always make use of all your resources. I also could've just picked them up. 
so that I have them. To throw at enemies, but I'm pretty comfortable not using them. When I do the Edge of the Abyss dungeon, I would go. I would have gone back <laughs> to get them. If you go in 99 floors deep, get every single supply you can every single time. But just for this, 23 floors, eh, it's not so bad. I don't think we need to prepare too hard. Hello, Holden Jar. Oh yeah, I keep getting used that light scroll. We'll use it eventually. When I remember. I doubt there's anything over there. <laughs> A really tempting fate with these uh, gazes for no reason. Pretty lax at the moment. As a change jar, I had a feeling it was. Of course, I can find change jars now, but not on my main file. <laughs> oh, that would have been pretty bad if that heal jar broke. Dragon herb. I don't know if that works on the boss, I forget. It might. Definitely willing to test it out. Still no doppelganger staff though. That's alright. I would also like a better weapon. Uh, without a better weapon, it's gonna be one heck of a long fight. With me healing a lot. Alright, let's light skull here. I don't wanna hoard them. Another shop, huh? If I could get one of those ants to tunnel to the shop, I might be able to steal this floor. I rather doubt they will, but if I could get that to happen... that tunnel. I don't really have space to steal and I don't know what's available in this shop but we'll think about it. If they can like come to the right and left <laughs> it doesn't seem like they want to. What do you got? Food? There's a possible doppelganger staff. Dragon shield. Oh my. Yeah. Yeah, I would like to steal. <laughs> <coughs> Man. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Me and my bad menuing. 
Drop that. Insert the 57. Let's pick that up. I'm not sure if there's a good way to coax the ant enemy to like dig to you unless they actually come down this hall again and sense me. Hey, Paka, you can't just come over here and give me a can <laughs> bop me and run away? What a dick. Oh man. This could be a huge waste of time. Dragon Shield would be nice to steal. Because it's a huge upgrade. Well, it's a little bit of an upgrade, but there are dragons in this dungeon. This I would like in case it's a doppelganger. And then another healing jar would be greatly appreciated, as well as the plating scrolls, so I don't have to worry about slimes, because I don't remember if they're here, and then I can just eat the food. I really need those ants to cooperate, though. I don't know if I can, like, convince them to? I might be able to convince them to dig around. I will try to encounter them, get them to follow me. Yeah, because they do that to try to get to you. So if I paralyze the one... Will the other one dig? That doesn't look like he wants to dig. If Oh, he dug! Okay, I need him to get on the other side now. Wait. Yeah, I need him on the other side. Or I need that guy to like magically wake up and come after me. I can try to make a pickaxe, but <laughs> it's not likely. Oh damn. Looking at that wrong, I thought it looked weird. Oh, me and my bad menuing. Eh, I got a bunch of eh, just stuff really. Uh, let's see if I can get that ant guy to help me. I'm gonna try and wake up the other one. I should wear this too while I'm uh, on this floor. Okay, he's awake. Dug up. I don't know if I'll be able to get him to dig to the like left. Well, he seems like he's doing it up there. <sighs> That's kind of risky. Can I get you to dig back down this way? Let's wake up this ant. <laughs> no, he didn't want to dig. I might have to like re paralyze in this hallway one of the ants and then try to get him to go the other way, though. I want the shortest route possible to get to you. <laughs> back to here. Hmm. 
Here, pitch plant. This is probably not worth the effort. And I will be running out of turns soon. For you, I'll just warp you away. Yeah. Hmm. Would this be good enough for me? I might be able to steal like this. If I can get a guy like paralyzed here and here and here. Maybe that should have been the tactic I tried. Okay. You! I can only paralyze two. So I want to make sure this hallway is clear. <laughs> Come on, Dozer. Yes, okay, you stay there. Now I need you to come over... Here. Okay, and my last paralyzed staff has to be for the <laughs> shopkeeper. I don't know if this is worth it. <laughs> oh, we'll find out. Just want to eat this real quick. Put on the, uh, well, let's see, can I make that? Heal. Calm prevents confusion. I mostly want the dragon and the staff. And the heal. Okay, we'll power up in case I have to fight. We'll uh, sell the other things to him because I don't really need them. Well, I mean, I guess the blast shield would be kind of cool if I found a melding charm. That's not likely. And this is my main file, so I'm not going to sell everything. But uh, we'll, we'll, ho we'll hawk his stuff. <laughs> Eat his food. Take that. I want this too. Good. And we'll read this on... To the dragon shield. <laughs> if I miss this guy, I'm gonna be pretty upset. <laughs> you two guys won't see this if this plan fails. Now I can see the map. So hopefully this works. I missed him. So he's coming to kill me now. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> I had a feeling I was gonna miss him. Alright. Alright, he's confused. Make a break for it. You can see on the map how the enemies generate. And how nasty it is. Now hopefully none of them really like come down the hallway. And hopefully... <laughs> I'm on a turn time limit. And like the bad dude's time limit. Now these hallways are still dark to the enemy monsters. Okay. They don't know I'm here. If they would just leave. 
Alright, he's coming. So... Alright, what do we want to do about you? I can find out what this is. Ceiling staff? That's not good for me. Doesn't really help me out. And this guy also has 250 HP, he just doesn't have ridiculous attack. Can I kill you? I can, but I'm gonna have to put you to sleep. <laughs> oh man. Probably wasn't worth it to do this. Alright, let's see if I can warp him away. Oh, he's confused now. One damage, that's not good enough. I need you to get. No, I need you to get. <laughs> yes! Okay. Good. Now I'm gonna try to run for it. Ooh, the one shot! Alright. He slowed. No! He was slowed! <laughs> His slowness wore off. Oh damn. The greed was real! I hope you enjoyed that, guys. <laughs> I probably won't do that again. <laughs> Alright, with feeling this time, with feeling. Finish this up real easy. Hopefully, I was set up for success there. I just really wanted to try and steal. And I got unlucky there. the staff a change. I wonder if that works on the guard enemy and stuff. I, I don't think he can change the shopkeeper. That would be pretty OP. <laughs> Just make him like a wimpy mammal. Alright, hit level 2, move on. Greed! <laughs> yeah, the greed is real. Hey, it's good DHR. Gonna have to be careful for a bit. Oh, mammal. That feeling when you're using wood arrows on the mammal. Yo, or you! It's good girl! Oh my. Eh. Fight. Probably need to level up to 3 before my HP will get stable. Okay, we got a monkey. I can handle the monkey. populated hallway. That's what I like to see. When I can handle it. <laughs> okay. So far, not really the greatest of items. I don't think.
Hey! Uh oh. <laughs> well, I have bags of money. So maybe I could para-level here? What hit this guy? Chintala. I don't know how much XP a Chintala gives. Oh damn, oof, oh the damage. I don't mean to walk into like this kind of place. Oh, it didn't one shot me. But it would take two hits to get away from it or charge my staff, so we'll just the money. <laughs> oh jeez. So they have more than 40 HP. How about yeah, alright, yeah. Oh man, revival herb burned already. <laughs> this is so bad. It's supposed to be a demonstration of how you can clear this. Preferably without dying. But whatever. I found the revival herb. It's legit. <laughs> Wasn't worth the usage though. Okay, got a random staff. And we have Oh, possibly a melding jar. Possibly an ID jar. Find out later. Well, ugh, I sh should just identify it. Melding jar! Should have did that at the get go. <clears throat> This is a really weird looking map. I wonder if there's any secret passages. That was a lot of empty space. amount of things <laughs> I think we'll be fine oh boy <laughs> maybe okay we're good nice and healthy way too frequently but big risks for big rewards I didn't want to use an item up Take out that dog yawn. Huh? 
That's not too good at the moment. Alright. Should be one more room. Nope, never mind. Just a loop. Hmm. Should be using this fullness more. Alright, this looks like a decent place to power up since we're gonna have to fight. This could also be a decent place to level up. Now that might be risky. Let's let the glare snake level up. I don't know if they give good XP, but we'll try it. Or if the gaze levels up, that could be terrifying, but I think we can deal with it. Try to let the gaze level up. I don't know what gives more XP. This is the kind of thing I should study up on. Okay. So we're going with the gaze. <laughs> I didn't really get enough space away from this thing. But I have an opposite scroll, so we're fine. Did that do 85 damage? I didn't throw- I threw 57. Why did that do so much damage to him? Uh, I suppose we'll opposite. Maximum safety. How much do I do? I do like nothing. So we'll throw our money. 4700, eh, it's okay. You see, he drops, uh, they always drop, like, a ridiculous number of Guitons. 5,000 for a Hyper Gaze. They always do that. So, we have a 500 damage nuclear <laughs> missile to whatever enemy <laughs> we want. Except for the boss. The boss would deflect the money. But, pretty good to have that. You could power level a dragon <laughs> if you're really ballsy, and if you don't miss the money bag though, you'll definitely kill it. <laughs> I think the dragon provides the most XP in the game, for basic monsters anyway, but I'm not sure. Alright, what do we got here? That's a healing jar. So easy to identify that in this game. And this could be a holding. Yep. All right, let's hold our nuke. And I don't know why I didn't use my identify on these jars. It's the only thing to use it on besides. Saves. Let's see, hold our food. All right, doing good. I just have to, uh, not get too greedy for a shop steal. Although, if I see some good stuff, I don't know, I might nuke the shopkeeper. The one way to kill a shopkeeper <laughs> would be a huge bag of guitons. So long as you don't miss. Remember, I missed paralyzing the shopkeeper. I had to confuse him and walk away. 
which was absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> I should have known at that moment it was not gonna go well. <laughs> Although he was irrelevant to me. I just got unlucky with that slow down dude losing the slow effect. I would like a free herb. Oh my, I actually got a free herb and found another poison trap. That would have been pretty annoying to step on. I'm gonna start using this fullness armband. We'll just wear it. Level 19 already. It's actually pretty crazy. I don't think 42,000 was too much XP for the gaze. Curious how much a snake would have given me. Yeah, I'd rather not walk on that. Darn pack of Repkins. They're reminding me of what I need to do <laughs> later on. They're like, yeah, don't forget, we're gonna completely stop that mammo of yours. <laughs> Let's see, take the herb, why not? Oh, something good to something okay. Well, good for offense. Melding jar! Uh, the escape scroll I may as well ditch <laughs> because we're not escaping. There's, we're, there's no item collecting on this trip. No, 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 no. <laughs> Alright, I don't really need to grind yet. We'll grind some more as we get deeper. give you yeah I'll take the poison back I don't know maybe I should have kept the poison herb it's so handy restore it's pretty nice oh damn <laughs> it's hallway monsters <laughs> oh, playing it a little risky Hey, finally found a shield. Alright, let's heal. There's no reason to be that risky. That I want. Just use this on, uh, I don't know, whatever. Scrolls of ID not as important here. Because there's only jars and staffs in each ID. And the jars that appear are limited.
probably should have picked that up though. I actually messed around with one of those guys when I was working to get up to this point. Because I had to play through all the other areas once more. I did that stuff off screen. And I leveled one of those guys up before. They're pretty nasty to deal with. I had a Sanctuary Skull, so it was alright. Get all Sanctuary Skull coming through. But they do deflect, like, everything. Alright, I'm not gonna hold on to the Antidote. I would like to hold on to the Restore, though. I don't have as many healing items as I did last time. Rapkin just doesn't know what it wants to do with itself. I think if an armband is cracked, the very next hit will always break it. I'm not sure. I don't actually remember. Okay, let's yeah, do something to you. Some, I was hurting. Tad. Man, he did a really good job just walking away from me. Oh, I forgot to pick that up again. It's alright. have a store I mean I could steal from this one maybe depends on where the stairs are it's the pack of meat makes it pretty easy to steal I don't want that the stairs are here I don't know if I could make it to here before the meat ran out Probably can. Okay, this I'm gonna hold. One more healing. I don't think I need the arrows currently. There would be no point in stealing though. Alright, these melding drawers are just wasting space. Since this is a temporary file, let's just meld those together. 
And I'll break that open a later. Maybe. leave. I have a good thing going for me. At the moment. And I don't want that meat, really. The piggy meat would be nice, but uh, meat's been so nerfed. It's not that great anymore. Did anyone else want a piece of shearing? Oh. Yep, <laughs> her sister does. Oh, I missed! She missed! Look, I'm just trying to get to a nice healthy set of HP. You guys just not leaving me alone here. Oh boy. Sanctuary Skull, you know what that means. Serious grind time. Not on this floor though. Should be encountering the dead samurai unit soon. That'll be the place to do it. Well. Kind of which shield is this? Wood plus one? Perfect. Perfect! It's probably the biggest waste of a melding drawer. <laughs> I just want to get some items out of my inventory. Alright, I rarely use this thing. Let's uh... Usually water doesn't go anywhere. You can take some cool shortcuts and dodge certain enemies. I mean, I could steal from this one real easy. <laughs> I can't go that way though. But I would just use the Paco meat. We would walk on the water here <laughs> and literally stay in the wall and then move into the staircase. Do I want the meat? Not really. The only good meat here is Bower. Could get like 40 to 50 wood arrows about. But uh... Eh. I'm thinking eh. Now, if there were two Paco meats there, that might be worth. So you could steal from another store. Alright, dead soldier. Oh, that guy? Oh, I actually don't like that guy, but... So it has been chosen. He's kind of weak, or... <clears throat> I don't know, 
there. What else can I throw at you? Nothing really. Oh, did I warp him away? Well, I don't want to bump into him in the hallway. That would be kind of a problem. I was hoping to slower confuse the guy. Oh no, my sanctuary dropped. Get wrecked me. <laughs> well, I guess we're grinding. Till I kill that Mega Takabi, I'm not leaving this room. <laughs> It's like the worst. It's really hard to deal with the uh, veteran. I only 1300. I don't know if that has a level 3. I should explore the rest of this floor. Before I grind more? Oh my goodness. Tons of pack of meat. Ah, think about fucking with you. <laughs> oh, and the stairs are right there too. Oh, uh, hello, it's a copy. Ow. Man, just think how bad the Mega one hurts, and like he gave me crap XP. <laughs> Jeez, there's a lot of enemies here. This is this tiny map, it's gonna be like the sideways T. I guess the branches here. Locked back, huh? Now the ultimate question is, if I kill the shopkeeper on this file, I bet it unlocks for my gain amount of weapon. I'm going to be reloading a safe state where it didn't, so I guess it doesn't matter. So I was very tempted to uh, <laughs> level up the shopkeeper. And kill him. I'm not sure how I would go about doing that though. That stumble trap is <laughs> uh, actually quite a hassle. Curse mom! That's like all the way over there. Oh, uh, how'd you get here so soon? <laughs> okay, what? Nah, -uh, no way. Get wrecked. Alright. Yeah, you wanna fight? I forgot to test the staff out. Well, since I'm not keeping the safe state, I'm not going to mess with the shopkeeper. But man, it would feel good to get him to level 4. I don't know if I can get him to level 4. I would need another doppelganger staff. I don't know if the... Like, if I pissed them off, and then st stood in here... Well, first of all, I would become completely surrounded. I would have wanted the scroll to be, like, here, because then I could just pack go after and get into the wall and get away. Wish you could pick this back up if it was blessed. The OP though. <laughs> Alright. 
What do we got? Kermit. Wow, this room is busy. See you later, suckers! <laughs> I do want to figure out what my, uh... This is... Oh, <laughs> swapping staff. Okay, it's funny. Now, when you're on the water... In case you don't know, but monsters will still hit you. It's just fine. Alright, well, the thing became cracked and it didn't uh, teleport me away, so... I guess it doesn't always break when it's cracked. God damn it, you guys. Oh, I can't hit you back. Hey, right, there goes my water walking powers. That's alright. I need more space. What do we got? Got a lot of fun stuff to, um... Could power level still. There's a spider kicking the staircase around. Wow, you got the spider? What? Uh-oh. I don't like my stuff being cursed. dangerous at level 2. Holy crap. Probably don't even give that much XP, do you? Ooh! Ooh! It's alright. Oh my goodness, he's gonna level up again. That's, uh, not alright. <laughs> um... Well, let's hope the blast wave kills stuff. If not, I have to knock back staff. Maybe I should let him level up. Sure, why not? I missed. <laughs> I would like to not use the big bag of guidance on this guy. Surely he's not that bad, right? Just 
Stay away from me. <laughs> oh my goodness, the iron arrow. Could you like cooperate? No. Not at all. Hey, I don't know when the slow is gonna wear off, but okay. 3500 for a level 3. It's kinda alright considering how much the uh level 5 or level 4 gaze gave us 5k. I think I'm gonna piece it. Yeah, we'll piece it and heal on the next floor. If we get a little breathing space, that is. Okay, go this way first. Got another one of these guys kicking the stairs. Okay, so it looks like I can't kick it into me. I don't see why they wouldn't be able to kick it through Sheeran. Probably just gonna meld. Alright, that doesn't have any pluses, so I don't need that one. Now, if this was my serious game, I wouldn't use the melt jar. I'd try to. Uh oh. Take it with me. <laughs> Food just got cursed. That's really bad. I'm gonna need some more food or we're gonna die of hunger. Should probably ceiling staff the curse girls. Take the extra turn to do that. It would be the safer thing. Smarter thing too. Or change them. <coughs> Haven't really been uh, utilizing my staffs as efficiently as I could. Kind of holding on to them for whatever reason. Alright, so we've seen this scene already, and I have found the uh, fast forward button. It's hot key tab, naturally. So we'll just skip this. We know all about the sand golem threat. <laughs> now, if they move that fast naturally, it might be a lot more threatening. <laughs> okay. Pack a weapon. Oh, I do have food. Okay. I'm not as worried now. Oh man, Kaji, no. Get, <laughs> get out of my way so I don't turn to you. Still really bad about that. Okay, now I'm definitely not worried about food.
really? As I step on two hunger traps. Back to back hunger traps. <laughs> Are there any more hunger traps? Yeah, actually, on these floor types, it seems like the traps are all the same. The last one that looked like this, they were all stumble traps. the shield before. I don't remember seeing that listed as special shields. Man, guys. Oh, I should have stole the pack of meat. I can kill the shopkeeper with this, but then I have to get through all the guards and whatnot. And I don't think I can kill the guards and whatnot. Man. Ah. Oh, two light spears. One of them's pumped to like at least a plus two or something. I don't know what this could be. Now, if I recall, the change doesn't work on shopkeeper and the guards. So I could seal them. So they only move one space per turn. I, I can seal the shopkeeper. I don't have a passage armband anymore. Man, I wish I stole that Paco meat. When you're doing a serious run, I guess always steal spare Paco weapon meat, even in this game. So you can steal from the future, <laughs> future fucking shops. Oh man, I could even meld this stuff. Oh! I want it so badly. I've never used the light spear yet, even though I wouldn't be able to keep it. Oh, <laughs> oh man. I want to see what it looks like. I want to see what it looks like. Oh yeah, my hammer's cursed. <laughs> I can't see what it looks like. Shopkeeper, come on, I'm trying to save the world here. You gotta give this stuff to me for free. Hold on. Oh, I forgot to get my money for that cursed staff. Like, the stairs are right here. If I had paralyzed staffs... We're switching staffs. Uh, if I'm lucky, I could kill one guard plus the shopkeeper if I'm lucky. Oh, man. <laughs> I just... I want it so much. I don't really have good stuff on hand to steal. And I'm pretty sure this room would be loaded with the enemy guard units. They usually appear near the staircase. Damn. I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna walk on and finish this. <laughs> well, thank you, uh, throw beetle. Getting smacked by a giant crab <laughs> is just what I wanted. Just kill him since it's convenient. I don't need the seal staff. Man, 
should have stole the pack of meat. <laughs> Even though I know this file's temporary, it's just for you guys so we can see the final boss and the special cutscenes together. But man, it hurts. <laughs> like, I want that stuff. <laughs> Okay, we'll get our opportunity in the actual game. Yep, spooky bombs. They won't make it. Oh boy. Really tempting fate there. I thought I would one shot it. This guy. If I had one more rice ball, I would show off his thing finally. But I do not, so I will not. Pretty lucky he didn't blind me there. Those guys are really tough. Excellent enemies to level up, I think. They gave good XP. And you can kill them with a rice ball in one hit, too. The melting guy. I don't think I can really make use of him. And now I kind of want him to die. Hopefully this works. I think he's going to eat it though. That's a, that's a problem. That's better. <laughs> yeah, I just powered him up. I thought he would eat it. I wasn't sure though. them because they're kind of tough. My weapon kind of sucks. I can think of a one way I could deal with them. I want to meld the shields I have but I have a melding jar I'm not keeping so we'll do it the safe way. If I want to meld at all that is. Alright, getting up there. Uh-oh. That has an unid drawer. Probably a change drawer. Hey, you can't get to those items. Sucker.
Okay, so you can't fire Guitons at Gathers either. Well, you can, but they just convert the damage to two. I would rather not be blinded here. Ah, the Sight Herb prev- Hold on a second. The Sight Herb prevents me from going blinded, so that's- that's a nice benefit to know. Oh crap, I forgot. Can't throw staffs at these guys and expect results. I mean, I would love to abuse them, but right now is not the time for me to do that. Just play it safe. I don't have, like, the best gear on hand to grind with. Alright, what we got? That helps. Feeds nice. Pickaxe! Except, who cares? <laughs> Are you a holding jar? No, you change jar. Guys, I mean, I could, I could try to use this one. Uh, that would be dangerous, though. You know what? I don't think I can use it. I was thinking, throw two things in it, and then I can throw the guidance at it. But if I throw the Guitons at it, it'll still eat the Guitons, it'll just drop them on the ground. I can put it to sleep. We'll just use the melting jar I have. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to walk. That was a mistake. I think we'll be fine. Okay. <laughs> All these traps in this room. Let's just put these guys to sleep. You know what? Since he's sleeping... <laughs> oh man, I wonder if I can still throw stuff in him. Wow, I missed. I can. Oh, 
Oh, that was unfortunate. But at least we know there's a safe way to farm them. You can put them to sleep and then power them up. Is this? Huh. I don't know. Yeah, you guys are over there. I think. Oh, I need to be over there too. They knew where the staircase was. Smart cookies. See, they just drain the charges of you. Stuff. I don't know if I can power level again. Oh, if I can get a purify, that'd be great. Oh my. This is a problem. Okay. First, seal it. You can't seal it. He converts the bolt. I'm gonna die. No. I have to use one of these up. Darn gathers. Hey, I should have sealed him first. Let's just change him for now. Man, you are an aggressive Paco. There you go. Get out of the way. Huh. I'm surprised that trap revealed itself when I swung diagonally. I shouldn't be able to hit that ground at all. Maybe they forgot to cover that. Actually, running low on supplies here. It wasn't a very good monster house. If I could have stolen from the store, we would be golden already.
we got? Hidden eye. I'll actually just seal you. <laughs> it's a good thing I didn't walk forward. Getting pretty lucky with the traps, actually. Not getting very lucky with the enemy spawns. Like, that was my fault when paying attention to my minimap. I would like to not have to heal the jar. Have you walked towards me? Do I have a rice ball? I do. Okay. That's good. Alright, some supplies finally. Much needed supplies. Hopefully that's a good staff. These guys have a lot of HP. This one's got like 65 or something. And then the other forms go up by about 20-ish a piece, if I remember. Alright, we're doing alright. Struggling a bit. Not the best weapon in hand. Shields on the average. I'm not confident about the boss fights. One revival herb, two heal jar charges for now. Okay, this is an ID jar, pretty sure. It's, it just ID that shield. I don't know for sure though. Let's put in this staff double check. Yeah, it's an ID jar. Let's ID... Uh, we'll just ID this and this. Why not? I want my stuff back out. If I can uncurse the other heal jar that we have, that'd be great. So, I want a purify scroll within the next Three floors. And I guess I'll eat the onigiri now before I step on a rotten trap. <laughs> Another doppelganger. Let's see if I can get a safe. Well, I have the bag of guidance, but if I whiff it, oh man, oh man, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. I don't do enough damage to this thing. I should have done that from the beginning. <laughs> Uh. Alright. I wish these guys didn't do so much. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Okay. Not okay. <laughs> oh, I missed. 
And we'll go back to healing. <laughs> Safety first, everybody. Uh oh. Get a tar. Damage split you. Damage split's actually a really powerful staff, so long as you can actually take the beating as well. I was hoping it would stay blessed for longer, but it did not stay blessed for longer. Wait, I need more supplies. And less dragons. Preferably less of these guys, too. No, they're not so bad. Can I heal up here? snaps. <laughs> um, hmm. Rather not die this guy. Okay. Oh man. Oh, jeez, can you guys cut me a break? <laughs> I'm not even holding, like, the B button at this point. Let's see if I can get into the room. I do appreciate that on a quick trap, but I'd rather have the hammer than not have the hammer. Let's see if there's, a, like, <laughs> a weapon in here, but there's not. There is no weapon. I need to move on to the next floor, running out of supplies. I'll heal if I can. Doesn't look like it. There's been so many enemies on this floor. Alright, do the short bursts of healing. Be safe. So Jahan Gate, pretty challenging. I'd say this is a lot more challenging than uh, Table Mountain was. Even though you're climbing up less floors overall. Pretty challenging. Definitely pays to be overleveled. I am looking for an opportunity to level up again. But it gets pretty dangerous here. I might just use the doppelganger staffs defensively. Alright, let's heal up. This looks like another small area. Oh man, I'm glad that trap didn't work. That was reckless. Haven't been checking for the traps, so this is just reckless play. And I don't mind playing Reckless because I'm pretty much showing that even with a lot of Reckless play, you guys can beat Sheeran. It's not possible to do. <laughs> it does require a little luck though. Alright, let's eat Lord Jonigiri. Hopefully the enemies chill out a bit. Damage split you. Casey crit. She didn't. Hey, 
it's another one of these rooms. I have to heal again after this guy, especially since I just whiffed. Ooh, two whiffs! Oh, that's the careless play I'm talking about. Although, the whiffs, you know, that's all I'm sharing. But I probably should have used the staff of some sort there. Alright, we'll be careful. We'll be careful. I am tempted to fight a dragon, though. Now, I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to beat the boss on this particular run. Because you need the healing jars. I need the, uh... Like a purify scroll or something. I just don't have any supplies. Unfortunately. And it's not good that I'm using the healing jars to get by. Oof. It's tricky. This is getting tricky. We were doing really well too. I don't know what happened. Just ended up drying up on good stuff. guy in here. Okay, so that doesn't really help me. That helps a lot. Hopefully I can save that for final bosses. Alright, if I want to power level, I'm gonna have to do it on, like, this floor. This is the last floor. And, uh... <laughs> it's now or never. Alright, let's back off away from Doppelganger so I don't get punched, even though this guy seems really determined to punch me. I miss here. How greedy do I want to get? I want to get really greedy. Because this guy is coming. Although this guy stops magic, doesn't he? Hold up. I need to remember if he's the one that stops magic or isn't. He stops the magic. Alright, this dragon's gotta die. Okay. <laughs> Did alright. I was hoping to abuse that. Because when you have that guy in bag kills anything in the game. Where's the iron shield at? It's right there. Escape scroll! Well, I'll save it for using it to heal. <clears throat> Alright. Melding. Don't really need the melding jar. These dragons are a problem. <laughs> Could try and do it again. 
it's not safe at all. Let's just kill the dragons. Besides, the melding, the doppelganger staff is actually good for me to hold on to when we get into the second form. It'll make a really good distraction for the slimes that appear, as we remember. So this is the last item in this area for me to take. And it's just an escape scroll. <laughs> Pretty abysmal items, considering. I would have had this stolen from the store to be really prepared, but let's see if I can manage without being really prepared. Dragons are relentless, but I can see everything on the floor. It's actually kind of safe here, so I can always just walk away from the enemy to heal. Uh, let's meld the shield. It'll be one point better. That's all we're gonna get, though. What are you? You're a fluffy bunny. Alright, someone else appeared. Goes a long way. Okay. So, three items to throw to the one heal jar. And this one. This is useless. This is useless to me. I can't uncurse it at this point. I can only heal f five times, so I'm not going to be able to eat. So let's get our HP up, we'll head straight to the boss and see if this can be a successful attempt. <laughs> this is the struggle attempt. Next time I guess I'll steal from the store to get spare pack of meat so we can steal from future stores. But let's see how this goes down. So this is the part everybody missed. Hopefully Twitch is recording. So as you know, you, know, you can't throw stuff at them. You can't. <laughs> uh, can't really do anything to this guy, except wail on him. I don't think we're gonna win because I do way too little damage, but we'll see. Gotta hope he misses a lot. Sometimes he'll knock you back. Oh, he just straight up killed me. I thought he wouldn't do enough lethal damage. So I wasn't prepared for that one. <laughs> Too ill prepared, but you put you want a better weapon, not a hammer minus one. Oh man, it's just stole from the shops. Alright, well that'll do it for this one. Now because I failed, I don't think I'll post this one to YouTube. We'll see. <laughs> So I'll shoot the real episode 11 when I return, which might be later tonight. I just have to cook some food for me and the family. So I'll give it a break here and we'll try to face down these bosses again. Take care everybody.